two of uh, Football Manager 2013 The Journey and I already discussed that I was back in the Premiership and uh, I told you I was going to do another video letting you know the transfer situation and what's happened so far and we are at September 3rd and as you can see on this screen the some of the transfers that's happened, some of the big ones Neymar's joined Man United Kubai joined Man City Andre Awu Awu joined Arsenal from Olympic Marseille. And let's see. Joined in twenty million deal he cost, which I don't know whether he's worth I suppose he is actually. He's actually quite a good player, this guy. Uh let's have a look at him, Midal. He's a good player as well. Liverpool with the biggest spenders, spending 65 million. Just register my team. Um, coaching assignments because I am missing some coaches now because some of them left and I currently have no money. I did made a few transfers, as many as I could, to try and strengthen as good as I could. Uh, <clears throat> but the board wouldn't really give me any money and I can't understand why. Um, the reason I say that is because I've made quite a lot of selling players but hardly been given anything to buy any players and especially considering I've just reached one month and they've told me I've made a profit of 1.6 million now you make a profit of 1.6 million a month and they can't give me any more for I can't even loan any players because they've not given me any wages I think they're giving me like an extra five you know I've got £5,000 a week to deal with or something. I can't even loan anybody. So I'm stuck with what i got. And let's have a look at what I've got then. <clears throat> As you can see, look, I'm actually minus in my payroll. And that's my transfer budget right now. But I'm making a profit still. Because they give me a very, very low payroll. And transfer history. Where's it gone? Transfers. There it is. History. And as you can see, look, so £24 million's worth and <coughs> spent 9.5 million 1.3 million on Jonathan from uh, Inter we got Asaidi from Liverpool Royston Drenthor I loaned Andy Carroll which he's so far been playing well as you can see look, 3 appearances, 2 goals and 7.5 rating in the league 7.3 rating overall he's been playing very well Sordell's not been playing so well I got this guy Ronaldo I think you, you've already seen some of these players and I'm just letting you know the situation anyways let's have a look at some of the matches and oh first I'll show you my squad and so I'm traveling right now I'll go to the taxi screen it's easier anyways what had been happening is I had Asaidi injured Bresson injured, Stuart Alden injured, this Gianni injured, <clears throat> and so <clears throat> I haven't had any cover. I've had to play Mikiva, as you can see, one and a half star rating, and Kelly the James Kelly, nineteen year old, one star rating, <laughs> and they've played the last two games and actually done pretty well, done better than I expected. I have had to play uh, Joe Riley at right back. So I've been scrimping and scraping by, but as you can see, I've been doing a very good job because I am in eighth with five points and a plus two goal difference. One win and two draws. Haven't actually been beaten yet. And if we go to the matches. There are the matches 1 1 with uh, Liverpool, 2 uh, 2 with Aston Villa. I beat Sheffield United in the Catalan Cup and I beat Fulham 3 1 in the league. And I've got some easier games Norwich and Reading in the league coming up and Aston Villa in the Catalan Cup. So we'll progress through now. I don't know why they're offering players now, even though. He has not got a club. He's not very good, but he's got some pace. 
and he could play on the wings so I might actually just if I could oops. can I have a rotation no for to see even if I have to let's see even if I have to key player I can only have a 1,900 a week and that's it so I can't even get Joshua King on a free transfer anyways Anyways, we'll skip the processing and I'll load it up when the match starts. <laughs> 